I was to describe Lisa Stalaker in one word, uh, it'd be a pest. Competitive. A cool, collected customer, that's pretty much how I describe Lisa and that she's just been a great servant for Australian women's cricket and, you know, leading into the World Cup and the Indian World Cup, I'm not sure how long she's going to keep playing for, but, um, yeah, she's just been a great servant for Australian women's cricket and also the New South Wales Breakers. Uh, Lisa has been someone I've played alongside uh, for my whole career, whether it be New South Wales, um, Australia and even club cricket so um, we've had a, a long time together. Um, I think the moment that sticks out for me is in the World Cup final against India in 2005 when her and Karen Rolton had a huge partnership which really set up uh, that match for us. I think she was 50, um, 50 in the final and Karen got 100 and that really just set us up. If I was to describe Lisa Stalaker in one word, it would definitely be childish. I know she's the oldest person in our team, but I think she matches me for immaturity sometimes and she's a heck of a lot of fun to be around. Look, when I, when I talk about Lisa Stalaker to people, um, I generally use nice words. Um, she's actually been an incredible role model for me um, when I first came into the New South Wales team and um, actually first coming into the New South Wales um, under-15 team, she was actually um, sort of coming through the Creek New South Wales in the high performance department and um, she sort of mentored me coming right through and then once I got the opportunity to play with her for the breakers um, it was pretty incredible and to you know, take that into um, playing for Australia is it's pretty special. She's an incredible player and has been for so long and um, to see the career that she's had it's been, been pretty incredible. I love standing on the field or sitting in the, on the sidelines watching her bat and bowl because um, I always learn something off her.